Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Shaville. And <coughs> as you can hear from my voice, I'm really sick. Today, I'll be doing a <coughs> sick glow up video for you guys. It's been raining a lot and I did go to school the other day <coughs> and I was caught in the rain. Maybe that's why. I'm not sure, but like I've been sick for like the past three to four days. <coughs> <clears throat> and I'm currently sipping on this warm honey water and also so I wore this hoodie the other day and I kind of like stained it <clears throat> wow that voice cracked though I'm not sure if you can see it here but <clears throat> it was like stained with foundation I tried my best to like <clears throat> get it off I think I did a pretty good job but like Hopefully we don't make the same mistake again today. All right, so first of all, um, I already went in with my brows. So I'm gonna start off with some primer. <clears throat> I'm using the Hourglass. I'm not sure if you can even see that. The Hourglass Veil Primer. I've been using this for ages and it's like my absolute favorite. I tend to put heaps around my under eye and just near my mouth. And a little bit for the top. And also I just moved the mirror from there to here because I really can't see my face from this tiny screen. <clears throat> so I'm done with primer. It leaves a bit of like a white tint, but it's not too bad. <clears throat> Then I'm just going to go in with my foundation. <clears throat> oh god, it's a lot of voice cracks today. Um, so I used the Maybelline 225 Dewy and Smooth. I literally just like <clears throat> smudge it all over my face and a bit for my neck Okay, and then I go in with my beauty blender I leave this part out like around my under eye only cause <clears throat> I'll be applying concealer and apparently um, if there's like foundation and concealer, it makes the concealer wear off a bit faster. So that's what I've been doing for ages and it works for me. All right, so <clears throat> now I'm done. Looking a lot better. So I'm just gonna Curl my lashes So I, <clears throat> I usually curl them like maybe three times Just to make sure that they're really cold <clears throat> And then I'm going in with my Better Than Sex Waterproof by Too Faced This is my absolute favorite I've been, I've gone through like <clears throat> four tubes of these always happens so I just add <clears throat> makeup remover and I just remove the rest but I usually go all out just so I get like the dramatic effect I don't know why but I can never apply it without smudging it all over my eye So, <coughs> so while waiting for my mascara to dry, <coughs> wow, my voice is literally gone. <coughs> I like to go in with my concealer. It's the flower concealer. 
It's ab my absolute favorite. <clears throat> I tried this like a month ago. I'm in the shade light medium. I just like to go into the, like. <clears throat> I'm gonna go in and dab out like my blemishes while waiting for my, my mascara to dry. And also my under eyes. I love this concealer just because it's really hydrating. And <clears throat> I tend to notice that my under eyes usually end up <clears throat> pretty like creasy, but this actually helps a lot. <clears throat> then I go into my cotton bud and some of this um, makeup remover from the face shop. <clears throat> and I just go in and remove all the extra mascara. Once I'm done, I'll use my beauty blender and actually just blend my concealer in. I've been so sick. All I've been doing is just staying at home. Like I think I've been in my house for like the past two to three days. And also, <clears throat> it's been like raining a lot recently so I guess it's a good thing as well <clears throat> I recently got back from Melbourne like last week though but I've been wanting to film like a haul of what I bought in Melbourne and just like trying the clothes that I bought there and everything but looks like we gotta wait. Mm. I'm honestly just too sick to do anything right now. I'm losing my voice. <coughs> so I'm done with concealer but I think I need a bit more just here. I tend to find that there's always this like weird patch on my left eye, like under my left eye and no matter how much of concealer I try to blend in, like the patch, the black patch just appears. It's weird, I, I don't know why. I'm not sure if you can see it but It'll do. <coughs> <coughs> All right, now I'm done with that. I'm going in with my <coughs> contour. So I'm using the Maybelline Master Bronze. I absolutely love this. And it's a drugstore, it's not that expensive as well. So I use this one. I'm not sure if there's like <clears throat> it doesn't come with a name, so it's just this one. Using an angle brush. I feel like contour plays the biggest part in like someone's makeup. Like <clears throat> I think a year ago, that's when like I haven't really learned how to contour it and I was looking back at my old photos and it was bad like the photos I look so weird in those photos because you could just see like my foundation <clears throat> and there was no like definition in my face so it just looked like I was just <clears throat> covered in one color and just looked really weird <coughs> so contouring is the way to go I prefer um, a warmer finish, so I tend to never use blush. <coughs> 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 mm. 
and I just go in just like with the extra <clears throat> bit of like contour <clears throat> I just go in like this just to create like a tannish look <clears throat> and a bit for the forehead And a bit here. <clears throat> Always start a tiny bit and then continue to build your way up. I guess I don't look as dead. Like if I don't start talking, you won't think there's anything wrong with me until you, until you hear this. And then <clears throat> I'm gonna go in with setting powder. I got this from Melbourne. It's amazing. I think it's like the new <clears throat> the new range as well. It's the let me sauce. Um it's a Laura Messier Invisible Loose Setting Powder. Apparently this is a lot finer compared to like their old range. <clears throat> Let's just get some. Like my makeup has been lasting for so long, especially like throughout the day, just because of this. I love it. It's definitely one of the things that I would not like try to like save my money on just because this is so good and I would definitely be purchasing another one of these when I'm done. Cheeks, contour area. And then I'll be <coughs> highlighting my face. So today I'll be using Too Faced Love Light <coughs> Highlighter called the prismatic highlighter <coughs> I'm not sure about you but I find my voice is still being right now and it's going in with the cheekbones I love my highlight definitely can't live without this as well a bit on the nose The brow bone, be on the top as well. And I'm using the Maria Badescu. <clears throat> Lavender facial spray Just to Oof, tasted a bit of them Just to hydrate my face And then I'm going in with Urban De Decay's um, Chill Setting Spray I love this because this is so hydrating And it actually makes my makeup last for so long And that's it. This is my sick glow up look. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. I know it's not a very long one, but I can't really talk that much anyway. So I guess I don't look too dead right now. And yes, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.